Good morning, everybody. So me and mom are out running errands. And look how creepy the sky looks. Okay, everyone. So, um, something unexpected happened. Um, I had a major panic attack. Um, I started getting really nervous, and really hot. Um, before I went into the grocery store to the pharmacy, and I had to switch over from Connecticut as well as put in my new uh, my new medicine from the doctor here. Um, and when she wrote Rite Aid down on the paper and then the address up in Connecticut, I just, the tears started coming and my mom, she was like, are you okay? I was like, no, I'm not okay. I'm not okay. Like, there's so much I miss about Connecticut. I mean, there is so much that I hate about Connecticut, but what I do miss of Connecticut is like, I really, really miss it. And like, the fact that I just had to come back here to a place I never wanted to be ever. I mean, even when I was a little girl, I was like, I don't, I don't want to live in Kentucky. I never wanted to be here. So just the fact that I had to come back, and then it's like, just hearing the country accents and you know everything, it just started really making my chest feel like feel like it's really tight and hurt, and I felt like I couldn't breathe, and um, I just really hate Kentucky. I just really hate it and um, it's really hard to stay positive and try and create this new life I guess you know like starting over and trying to keep myself motivated in a place where I don't want to be at all where I never have wanted to be and it's kind of like just I feel stuck I really feel stuck like this is where I have to be, and this is probably where I'm going to end up dying, but I, just, I can't handle that. Like, I don't want to be here. And when she wrote Rite Aid down, I just remembered, like, going in and getting the drinks that I would get, and seeing the same pharmacist, and, you know, being able to walk back home, and it being my home, and there's just so many things that I miss that just it just hit me all of a sudden and even I woke up from a dream this morning that I was in New York you know like I just I don't know why I always wanted to live in New York City but I always did um, it's, it's just I hate Kentucky and I don't want to be here and I don't know I'm, I'm finding it really hard this week to stay positive and motivated and I just feel like when I have my down times sure I can like vent to you guys and to some of my friends but it's like I don't have a person in my life who really understands who really who, who's like at a higher level than me who can like kind of lift me up when I'm down you know like I feel like I'm the person that has to kind of always be the person to to lift everybody up and try and make other people happy and I just you know I need that same thing when I'm down and it's just hard to find someone whose energy and motivation and everything matches mine I guess so it's just really hard I think that's why I watch um the Shay Tards a lot because I feel like Shay would be like the best person for me like you know to get me motivated to get me pumped and everything but um Thank God I got a beer because <laughs> I'm going to need it tonight. But, uh, yeah, I'm probably just going to stop. I know I'm rambling, but uh, honestly, that's going to be it for today. Um, I'm not doing anything tomorrow, so I think tomorrow I'll just update you guys on everything that's going on, too. Um, so, yeah, thank you for all your support for letting me vent. And I know I'm not the most entertaining person on YouTube, and quite frankly, I don't care. <laughs> so... Anyway, guys, I will talk to you tomorrow.